Hey everybody, this is Brett with Summit Auto and today I'm excited to show you this brand new 2022 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Bighorn Sport Package. Stock number is 22T10. Uh, really a good looking truck. This one has the tech package on it, has the protection group. It comes with the 20 inch polished aluminum rims, which is a $1,695 option. Uh, the sport package, which gives you the painted bumpers on there. This truck has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine and is in granite crystal metallic. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities, turn them on now because it is your best way to check out the looks, styling, and options of this truck before seeing it in person. And that's exactly what we're gonna do in this video. I'm gonna do a walk around. We're gonna check out all the options that make this truck unique. We're gonna take a look at the original window sticker, hop inside, and at the end, we'll start it up, turn on all those LED headlights and running lights. And once again, granite crystal is the color. Notice you get the painted front bumpers, part of that sport package, the front bumper parking sensors on there as well. You can see that it does have the LED headlamps. It even says Ram LED on there. And take a look at this granite crystal. It's got a lot of metal flake to it. So really a good looking color, especially in the sunlight, it really sparkles. And these are my favorite rims on the heavy duty trucks, the Ram, or at least the Ram's uh, heavy duty 20 inch polished aluminum rims. And they come with Firestone Transforce AT tires. These are LT285 60R20s have an all-terrain tread pattern to them. Uh, one cool thing about this truck is it does have the auto leveling rear air suspension, so we'll check that out as well when we get to the back. First thing I wanted to do is show you the original window sticker here. I'm not gonna go through everything, but we'll go through most of it. You can see it's a 2022 Ram 2500 Bighorn Crew Cab. Granite Crystal, 6.7 liter Cummins diesel, has the 68 RFE six-speed automatic transmission. Everything on the left here is standard equipment. And then your optional equipment starts right there. The Granite Crystal color is 200 bucks. Premium cloth bucket seats are 295. Now the tech package is a $3,000 or $29.95 option. Gives you the Uconnect 5 navigation system with the 12 inch radio display, off-road pages, premium black power tow mirrors, front LED fog lamps, center stop with cargo view camera, mirror mounted auxiliary reverse lamps, LED reflector headlamps, um, nine Alpine speakers with subwoofer, the Sirius 360, the surround view camera system, and the trailer reverse guidance system. We're gonna check all that out and especially the radio um, in just a second here too. So protection group, which gives you the transfer skid plate, um, transfer case skid plate is 95 bucks. The sport appearance package is $9.95, which gives you the painted bumpers and the black interior accents. Fifth wheel and gooseneck prep is $5.45. Level B equipment group is $4,265. So that gives you the bed 115 volt AC outlet, the second row and floor storage bins, the heated front seats, the rear power slide and rear window. Um, or the rear power slide window, the AC with dual temperature control, the eight-speed, eight-way power adjustable driver seat, heated steering wheel, steering wheel mounted audio controls, park sense front and rear park system, remote start, uh, 400 watt inverter as well. This one does come with a 220 amp alternator, anti-spin rear axle, which is 495. The Cummins diesel is a 9,400 bucks, 9,400 dollar option. Uh, clearance lamps are 95 bucks. LED bed lanes 165. Rear wheel house liners are 195, and the automatic leveling air suspension is 1705. Those wheels are 1695, and the spray and bed liner is a 600 dollars option. So really a nicely equipped truck. It's got just about everything that you'd ever need. 74,210 is the MSRP on this one. If you want to get your summit price in the upper right-hand part of the screen, we have a link to our website. Click that and check us out there. Uh, with any rebates and incentives. Not sure what we're asking for this truck right now. I didn't check before the video, but um, crazy times with the chips sh shortages and everything. Uh, our trucks are going really, fa <clears throat> really fast, especially after I do these videos. Uh, three year 36 bumper to bumper and five year 100,000 mile powertrain. You get the five year 100,000 powertrain because of the Cummins diesel. There's your environmental performance C plus on the greenhouse gas rating and B plus on the smog rating. 
four and five stars pretty much up and down the board uh, for the Ram 2500. So pretty safe vehicle. The only one with three is the rollover, but everything else is five and four stars. So really good there. I did want to hop around to the back of the vehicle. So a couple things to go over back here with that rear air suspension. So you can see if you look right up there, that's your rear airbag. So that will actually pump up if you get a heavy load and uh, it'll level out the truck. You can actually have alternate trailers on there uh, programmed into the system. So that's pretty cool. Notice the painted rear bumpers, the LED tail lamps. You get the sport lettering on the side as well. So that's just a sticker. So I know a lot of guys don't like that. Um, you can always just remove it. It's just a sticker. One thing I really like is it has the shock down assist tailgate, so it's never going to slam down on you. You get the LED bed lighting, the fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package, which also gives you seven pin wiring back here. And then this is a hookup for um, trailer cameras that you could hook up to the vehicle. So that's pretty cool as well. They have a button back here to turn on those LED lights that also turns on your LED lights up there on the cargo lamps. And that is also where your cargo camera is. You also have a 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in back here, which is nice as well. Notice you get a bunch of tie downs on the side. So, you know, this truck's all ready to go for whatever you may need to use it for. Has the chrome emblems on the back. Checking out these mirrors up here. It has the heated fold up tow mirrors. So they fold up, they have directional signals, they power fold in, they have LED side lights. You turn those on with the cargo cam or with the cargo lamps, I should say. And then you have the 360 camera there as well. And those mirrors do power fold in, which is pretty sweet, especially on the passenger side. Um, because it'd be hard to fold that in. The other thing that these mirrors do is they have a power blind spot mirror. And for the same exact reason, if you need to adjust that blind spot mirror while you're sitting here or you're by yourself, it's really nice to have that option to uh, adjust that blind spot mirror from the driver's seat. You get the wood grain trim on the doors, the gray cloth bolsters, which match the material on the seat. You get the gray and black trim on the seat like the design on there power driver seat both these front seats are heated with the level b group factory floor mats auto headlamps and power pedals we'll hop inside take a look at the instrument cluster the radio and everything that this truck has to offer on the interior so you get the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer. You get a compass, uh, range to empty. Um, you can put mileage up there, the time, whatever you want it to read, pretty much you can put in those different corners there. Has the heated leather wrap steering wheel. I like that Ram, Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep. Hasn't really changed their steering wheel lay layout very much over the years. Um, and they're all pretty much the same whether you go from a Jeep to a Ram to a Dodge to a Chrysler product. They're all pretty much the same. So that's pretty nice. Cruise controls, gear selector, Bluetooth and information center controls. And they do have those audio controls on the back. Um, just the six speed automatic transmission shifter there. The Alpine sound system. And then this is the Uconnect 5C radio. It has the factory navigation system on it. And it uh, takes up the whole screen. Um, looks really good. You can do your media here, your radio, AM, FM, Sirius XM radio capabilities. You can go to the home screen, which gives you the split screen there. So you have your radio and your um, nav system there. You can either make that big or that big, or you can edit it. You can go to your climate controls. So you have your heated seats, heated steering wheel buttons. Um, you can do uh, your bed lowering mode, which is kind of a neat system. I think uh, gotta have this on like that. 
and then we can check out the vehicle cameras there as well so you can do your surround view camera which is right there and then you notice that you have the backup camera there and just take note of how HD um, high definition that camera is it's very crisp very clear uh, and you have a narrow view a wide view a wide view of the front and a narrow view of the front and then you can check out the cargo cam as well and once you get to this screen you can check out the backup camera you can zoom in on your receiver hitch and you can go to your trailer um, a park assist system so basically you can watch what's going on with your trailer either to the left or the right and you can zoom in on that side too make it more um, prominent on one side or the other and adjust the angle of those cameras really a cool system um, you know and I really wish I had this on my truck when I'm parking my camper because I got a big camper and it's not fun to do that then you have you can see you have the AUGS 2 um, that's if you'd have the camera hooked up to your trailer on the back of it or whatever remember I was showing you that um, in the bed they have that I think it's a 20 pin connector that uh, connects for those cameras that hook up to the trailer you can even put trailer surround cameras on there as well so uh, really really a cool system um, and we could go over this this radio for hours uh, but just a couple quick things that they have on here now they have the off-road pages which is just like how they had the Jeep pages before you have your steering angle um, your latitude longitude on there you have ex accessory gauges I think this would be handy if you're towing a heavy load make sure that your trans isn't getting too hot or your oil temperature isn't getting too hot and then you have your pitch and roll also very handy if you're going down um, a mountain or a hill or something and you're towing something you want to make sure that your pitch isn't or your grade isn't too uh, steep a lot of cool stuff that you can do with this radio um, you can see all the different apps there um, weather SOS all that good stuff like I said we could go over this radio for hours and hours but we'll get back to the truck here push button four-wheel drive factory brake controller that's for your alternate trailer height that's what part of that rear air suspension system so you can actually uh, program a couple different trailers in there factory exhaust system tow haul mode front and rear parking sensors uh, two USBs two USB C's and an aux jack and down there you get a 115 volt 400 watt plug-in keyless entry with the remote start the dual glove boxes on there up here you get your map lights um, assist and SOS buttons power side mirror window button auto dimming mirror and then you get your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems <clears throat> and you can program up to three of those you do get the latch child safety system back here the power side and rear window with the built-in rear defrost you do get the load floor I like that uh, when Ram redesigned their heavy duty trucks, they kept this. This is a really nice system, especially if you got muddy boots or tools, put them on there. Or if you got pets, put both sides down. They got a nice flat place to lay and they're not gonna wreck your nice seats. Storage underneath there. The other side has the factory subwoofer. And then you get the in-floor storage, part of that level B group with removable containers, two USBs and two USB-Cs, and then another 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in, side current airbags on all the rams, and you do get child safety locks on the back doors. One other thing to note is you get the speakers in the ceiling, part of that Alpine premium sound system. And as promised, we're gonna walk around the truck here <clears throat> with all the lights on. And I think I'll even turn it on just so you can hear how nice and quiet um, it runs. And we'll take a look under the hood too. Why not? So you can see all those LED lights. When you turn the cargo lamps on, it'll turn on all your LED lights. You have the LED tail lamps there as well. And then there are those side lights I was telling you about on the mirrors. They don't look that bright right now, but if you get right in line with them, they are extremely bright, which lights up the side of the truck pretty nicely. And then you get all those LED headlamps and fog lamps and running lights. Really a good look. It kind of sinks right in with the Ram logo across the front, so it looks really good. And the clearance lights up top they are all LEDs as well. 
And this is a diesel. This is this is how quiet these are. They're really amazing how quiet the six sevens have become. I mean, they're always one of the quieter ones um, back in 08, 09. Uh, but they've really quieted them down. Nice. Really a sharp truck. Granite crystal, painted bumpers, sport package, big horn. Uh, I'm pretty sure this one will go pretty fast. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to that website right there www.summitauto.com full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations all at summitauto.com if you'd like to check out more hd videos you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto remember to like subscribe and share on this video and all the videos that you see there click the bell notifications you'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day here at summit auto in fact in a second you will see a link to subscribe to our youtube channel in the upper left a link to more ram 2500 truck videos like this one in the upper right a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left and a link to one of our latest youtube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. And we're super excited to be offering the 2022 Ram 2500 Bighorn Sport Level B in granite crystal metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share.